Neon is like the WWE of the streaming community because everything he does, every time he has a moment on stream, it's scripted. You might know him as Ronnie 2K's son, which I actually thought he was Ronnie 2K's son, so I found out that was fake. Then I found out the kid had cancer. I was like, oh my gosh, he has cancer. No, he faked that too. Then I saw he got jumped by three kids, men, teenagers, whatever. They took his shoes. No. That was fake too. So what makes me think that what I'm about to show you guys today of Neon getting robbed for his chains and clothes is real? Well, I'm here to tell you guys it's all fake. It's all fake to get the views up, man. You know what I'm saying? Now, Neon's a good... I'm not hating, by the way. Neon, you know, he's doing good on kick, but I just got to expose what he's doing, you know, for the people that think this is real, you know, the little kids. I'm just letting you guys know uh, it's all fake. So Neon was hanging out with Lexington's most dangerous person. Punch made Dev. He was hanging out with Punch made Dev. Punch made Dev was gonna take him on a shopping spree for a stream. So he takes him on a shopping spree. They buy some clothes, shoes, got some ice on his neck. But then, okay, after we're gonna rob Neon on camera in front of thousands of people. Here we go. Let's break down this footage, man. And I'm not gonna lie. When it comes to bad scripts, fake robberies on YouTube, fake this, fake that. This is up there for a good one. Like, this is this is good. All right, you know, it's not too obviously fake. It's obviously fake, but it's not too obviously fake. It's up there with like WWE X type of scripts. Let's, I'm trying to tell y'all, bro. Shoes, be honest, bro. Like Neon I'm knows shoes, what he's doing. He's trying to distract y'all, all right? He's trying to distract y'all from what's about to happen. Look at the shoes. How are the shoes? Let me see your chain. Let me see your chain. I need one of those on God. On God, I need one of those, bro. Okay, so like he has a chain on. So why do you need a chain? And like, oh, look at the shoes. We got the same fucking shoes on. Oh, shoe, shoe, shoe. No, all right, listen. He's trying to distract y'all from what's about to happen. Now, here we go. This dude dead now, this is really good setup. Setup really good. I mean, he's walking out alley. It's perfect, See, perfectly set up. Now, this guy is just sitting back there. He, I know he pops out on y'all like he popped out on Neon. I, I didn't, you guys probably didn't expect him to run out like that. Me either when I was watching this. But he's back there waiting the whole time. Now, if someone got robbed in this type of fashion... I'm not going to lie. This seems like a real robbery. You know, he pulls out. You guys already know what that is. I got to blur that out. He pulls out the mouse tool. Now, obviously, his finger's not by the thing you pull to shoot somebody. Um, We're talking about shooting water guns, YouTube. But he's not, you know, finger's not by the thing you pull to shoot someone with the water gun. So they're both on top of Neon for a, a long time. Look how long they, they, they stand on top of it before someone even moves. Now, it, now, look. Now, look, bro. As soon as I see... This man running out. Oh, I'm God. gone. Right here. Soon, how many steps did he take? One. Second step. Turned around with the camera. Running. Neon, you're, you're there for yourself. I'm not, I'm not going to lie. You talk too much shit online to, for you not to defend yourself right here. So you're there for yourself. I'm gone. But apparently the cameraman oh, is going to sit here and watch his friend get robbed. And then hold up. Here's the funniest part of it all. Neon, another person in Neon's crew. Just standing there. Standing there watching. Still, I, like, I mean, like, I'm not going to lie. If you're with your friends, right, and one of your friends get robbed, are you just going to stand there and watch? Like, you're either going to jump in or run away. I don't think anyone's just standing there and watching. But, hey, maybe I'm wrong, and maybe this whole thing is real. But I'm here to tell you guys, he's already faked three different incidents online, bro. It's like the boy who cried wolf. So if he actually did get robbed, no one's actually going to care because, you know, the boy who cried wolf, when he got ate by the wolf, no one gave a fuck. But I'm just here to let you guys know right now what uh, Neon didn't actually get robbed. I know I said that already, but just please don't feel bad for someone that's faking events that actually happen. IRL, the real people. And don't don't think Neon actually got robbed because, I mean, bro, I mean, this is just so terribly bad. They're like giving him tickles on the ground. When someone gets robbed, they're going to, you know, they're going to do it quicker than this. I mean, they're like, they're, t they're touching his body. And head, paws. But, like, they're touching all over his body. They're not even trying to grab for the chains. They're not even trying to grab for the clothes. Yeah, I mean, now that I look at it, maybe it's not that good of a script. Maybe it's fucking not. I mean, this is just, uh, corny. I'm sorry to all the Neon fans I heard today by this devastating news, but, hey, maybe Neon is the smartest streamer of all time. You know what I'm saying? Maybe my next video, I'm gonna post a fake robbery on me. Let's see how this goes. None of them up. None of them stuck. Ain't no more love. Carries up an ear, but it could have bought a trash. I had to cook the dope up on the side.